If you've been looking into the community of Eastmark, but you're looking for a home that has a little bit more of a luxury feel to it, this is absolutely gonna be the video for you. We're gonna be taking a tour of one of the most fantastic floor plans that I have seen in a long time here in this fantastic community, so stay tuned. If this is your first time on my channel and you wanna know everything there is to know about living in Phoenix, Arizona and the surrounding suburbs like Mesa, which is where Eastmark is located, make sure you go down below and hit that subscribe button. Also, ring that little bell for the notifications. That way you can be the first person to know about all the goings on here in the Phoenix Marketplace. My name is Brian Elder, and I get calls, texts, and emails every single day from people who are exactly like you. And you, and you, and you, and you, and you, who are all thinking about moving to this great place. So whether you're moving in six days or six months, it does not matter. Feel free to go down below and give me a call, send me a text, shoot me an email, or schedule a Zoom call. You'll find all that information down in the description below, and I can help you make a smooth move to the Phoenix area. Okay, so today we find ourselves back at Eastmark, my favorite community in all of Arizona. That is no secret if you've watched my channel at all before. And today we're gonna be taking a look at the Woodside Elegance Series. So these homes are absolutely stunning. If you haven't seen the other model, you absolutely need to check it out. I will have a link at the end of the video to that one. It is beautiful, but this one in particular really has a lot of wow factor to it. So I can't wait to show it to you. This is the Charm model. It is well named, I promise. It is 3,168 square feet, three bedrooms, three and a half baths, a ton of cool features to it. I just don't want to spoil the surprise because it is absolutely something you have to see. So without wasting any more time, let's go ahead and go inside and check it out. All right, here we come up to the Charm. So kind of a cool front courtyard here. So good amount of seating and then double doors at the front. You don't see that very often. And goodness, these are big heavy metal things too. And my oh my, check this out, wow. Look at that, look at those beams, that is so cool. And a master, masterful kitchen, holy cow. Let's not forget this sitting room, because this would be easy to walk by. So this is a cool little feature. Tree ceiling, built-ins, all that, those are upgrades, um, as is the tiled wall, but just gives you an idea of what you can do with this space. So just a little bit of extra living area here. It does have a window to keep an eye on the folks in the courtyard there. But yeah, this is really cool. I love this, wow. And it's got my favorite, the 90 degree sliding door. We'll demonstrate here shortly. But let's start here with the kitchen, shall we? Nice looking cabinets. Got the microwave and the oven below. No fridge, which is fine. That's how it comes anyway. Any fridge that you see in a model is for demonstration purposes only. got this burly looking gourmet cooktop cafe model fancy and the hood vent overhead backsplash is cool I like it when they kind of do the two separate textures of it that always gives it a good look let's wheel around here and take a look at the island so we've got the two-tone color scheme the dishwasher over here and a dual basin sink. Got some cool looking pendants over the top, but yeah, this is a beautiful living area. Oh man. And then over here, I love it when they do this. So they have the dining area kind of with its own separate spot over here. So it's not totally out in the middle of everything, but it's still very connected to the main living area. I really like the way that they do this. It's not really a formal dining area, you know, where it's all closed off. Very good use of the space. Still a part of all the happenings out here in the main living area. Which is big, by the way. So this couch is huge. You couldn't tell from the video here, but yeah, this thing is great big. Got the fireplace built in, TV hung over the top. Lots of room in this living area. Love it. Okay, since we're here and I can't stand the weight any longer, let's 
show you what this thing does. This is one of my favorite features when they have this in the model home. Now, granted, this is an upgrade and it's usually a pretty pricey one, but it's just so cool. So, if I don't run into the wall behind me too hard, you can see you can just open up that one section, which is kind of nice, but this is where the magic happens. Watch this. The 90 degree opening. Indoor, outdoor living at its finest. Love it when they do that. And this patio area, also huge. So goes all the way out here. Most likely this is extended a little bit. I imagine that it probably doesn't include that. We'd have to check with the sales office, but that is most likely an upgrade on this thing. Even without it though, still very generous in terms of size so it's got a decorative fireplace about 100 degrees today so you're definitely not going to need it but look at that just love how the two spaces are blended when you have that great big door that opens up all the way okay let's check out the backyard just briefly so good sized lots here love that so you can see there's plenty of space on the side of the home you're not bumped right up against your fence. Didn't put a pool in, but you totally could. Plenty of room for it. Most of these lots are about 10,000-ish square feet. So, pretty large in terms of what modern uh, <laughs> builders are offering these days in terms of the homes. So, cool backyard make that a really nice space and again just love this big shaded area again it's about 100 degrees today and here in the um, shaded part of the patio it feels pretty comfortable even without a ceiling fan they did include you can see the little pucks there and there to put a couple ceiling fans if you wanted to love the 90 degree slider Okay, let's continue the tour. Let's go kind of finish off the kitchen here because I have yet to see a pantry and I bet it's back here. Yes, indeed. So more counter and cabinet space. Oh, cool looking backsplash too, I like that. Got a little window to let some light in and oh yeah, great big pantry. So shelves go all the way up to there. Lots of food will fit in there. And then we have a little mud room over here. So again, more cabinets, a little built-in bench that's cool. Even some storage up there. That's gonna go out to the garage. Which again, if uh, you saw as we were walking up, there's a two bay and then a single bay on the other side. So it is a split. Garage. Let's see, let's go down here first. So here's your powder room. Got the pedestal sink. Put the mirror. Let's have a window to keep it light. And the booth on the other side. And what do we got here? A little closet, yep. A little coat closet. And a very nice laundry room. So there's your washer dryer. Plenty of storage over the top. Lots of cabinets and counters and a sink. And some window for a natural light. Yeah, I like this. So we've got a linen closet here. Very nice. And boy, lots of drawers, cabinets, all kinds of stuff. So this is cool. We have a second living area over here. Good size, fits plenty of furniture and a TV, so if you have someone who needs a little extra space, kids, parents, whoever, find it here. And here is 
bedroom. Like it. Again, the ceilings are nice and tall in here. Lots of windows. And this bathroom is ensuite. So there's your vanity. And our toilet. Just went with the standard shower on this one. And turning over here, we have the little walk-in closet. And across the hall, we have another bedroom. Very nice. Again, these are pretty good, you know, good spacious bedrooms. Didn't really squeeze you in here. And also en suite. Here, toilet. And again, just the regular fiberglass shower. You know, didn't go too fancy on that, which is fine, because again, that's how it comes. So. Very nice. And another walk-in, so good amount of space. Really like this floor plan a lot. Yeah, especially when they give you that secondary living area, that's always cool. Okay, let's make a little detour over here. Yeah, like that kitchen. Love how open this is. Let's check out the master bedroom. Great big windows, tons of light in here. This is a great space. And the tray ceiling, of course. Got a TV hung here. A dresser below it. But yeah, lots and lots of space in this bedroom. Love all the windows and how bright it is. Very nice. So we have carpet transitioning to tile. And that's some fancy looking tile. There's the shower out in the middle with the tub. So it's always kind of cool when they do that. So around the corner here we've got the vanity, the first one. And then turning around over here. Second one. Yeah, this is a cool layout. And a little linen closet right here. Again, they put a good amount of windows even in here in the bathroom, so nice and bright. You can see they have the three over there. And this is a cool looking shower. I mean, it's Kind of a nice mixture of tile and glass, so it's not one of those humongous glass things that uh, you'd be stuck cleaning all the time. Good amount of tile in here, and very large, so. Good amount of space in that shower, sure, that's cool. And here's our closet. So, shelving and hangers over here. Yeah, very nice. It does come over here just a little bit. Very nicely done. This is a beautiful home, to be sure. Woodside really did a good job with this. Charm model. Let's quick look at it here at Elegance at Eastmark. Okay guys, that's gonna wrap up our tour of the Charm model. And I really do dig that place. I think that everything about it, especially that living area is so cool. So if this is the kind of home that speaks to you as well, let's make a plan to go see it together. Give me a call, shoot me a text, send me an email, or let's schedule that Zoom call and we'll go in there 
check out that bad boy together. I really do love that home. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you find this content helpful, make sure you subscribe to the channel and give me a like. It really helps me out a ton. I do appreciate your support all the time. Thank you guys so much again. Feel free to uh, keep an eye open. We're going to have some more videos here from Eastmark coming really soon. And I'll see you again very soon on another model home tour.